another day, another space fun. Hey! Hello everyone! I hope you're all having a wonderful day or night or afternoon. I started my day today and I was like, you know what? Am I in the mood to do anything at all productive? No. Am I going to? Yes. So as you guys saw, I did my workout this morning. It was hard. Like, it was a tough workout, but we pushed through and we did it and you know what? I'm glad. Honestly, I had no desire to do my makeup today, but then I was like, you know what, Sophia? Like, you always feel more productive and you feel better when you do your makeup, so I'm gonna do my makeup and I figured this would be the perfect time to do my everyday makeup routine with you guys. I just put on a little bit of moisturizer, nothing too crazy, and I don't normally wear this every day, but I put on the Fenty Beauty Primer just because I feel like my face needed that little extra umph. But I normally start off with the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. You guys know I love this. This is my go-to primer. It just really like sets everything really, really nice. Um, Updates. I bought a new computer. <laughs> I bought a new computer like two days ago, which I'm really, really excited about um, because my computer is like five years old and it doesn't work anymore. Like when I plug something into the computer, the computer like ejects it and stuff and I lose memory and I lose storage and all that stuff. So it was literally like not functioning. So I was like, you know what? It's, it's time. <laughs> Next, I would normally go in with the professional primer, which I use all the time. Love this stuff. And I just put a little bit on like there. <laughs> yeah, on the schedule for today is not too much. I just had planned to vlog, which I'm doing, and I need to figure out what I want to do with my grad cap. So hopefully we'll figure that out. I'm actually working a few virtual privates later today, which is exciting. Yeah, that's pretty much what the schedule is entailing. I'm also in between foundation shades right now because I got a tan like at the very, very beginning of all this craziness, and I have not been able to tan since, so I'm kind of like not dark enough for my spray tan foundation, but darker than like my normal foundation so i'm gonna try my normal foundation and maybe just like bronze it up i don't know i don't know or maybe this shade will like work i don't know we'll find out together this is the same foundation that i always use it is the fenty beauty 190 shade pro filter also hi my space buns are back because you know what it's another day of being stuck at home and another day of sophia not wanting to wash her hair <laughs> question of today's vlog what tv show have you been binging because for me it's been katie keen i love that show it's a new like the new riverdale spinoff show and i I absolutely love it. I'm obsessed with it, but currently like playing on TV, like on I think the CW. Like it's not on Netflix or anything, but I bought the season on iTunes and I've been binging like every single episode and I'm finally caught up, which is annoying because I have to wait every week, but you know. <laughs> if this vlog goes up on Thursday, which is when I want to get it up, then there's a new episode that night. So yeah, see what else is happening. Worlds is canceled. <laughs> Made the announcement, I guess, that it's canceled, which really sucks, but you know what? I feel like at this point, it is what it is. Um, I'm really excited for next season and I'm excited for what's gonna happen with that and I feel like this whole experience is really just gonna like remind everybody not to take anything for granted and have us all enjoy the next season. Okay, next. Concealer, Tarte Shape Tape. I'm just gonna do some under my eyes and then my problem areas. I broke out like recently because uh -huh, girl time. So <laughs> that's a thing. And we're gonna blend that out. You guys know I love makeup, but like I never really change up my products. I'm a tried and true like if you work you work and that's it. If you have any good makeup product recommendations definitely leave them down below. I'm always looking to try new things but inevitably I kind of just like stick to what I know but now the concealer's on we're gonna go with powder. I've been using the Laura Mercier translucent setting powder because this stuff is amazing and I feel like I rarely need to like touch up my makeup when I have this on. I put some of that all over. Now we're gonna set and spray it up. Wow, I feel very pale right now. <laughs> Next, we're gonna do bronzer. I've been using the Hoola bronzer. I love this bronzer. I think it is absolutely amazing. Nice big fluffy brush and bronze it up. Okay, now I'm gonna use my little mini Cap on D shade and light contour palette and I'm going to contour. I'm gonna use the darker shade to contour and then the lighter shade to highlight and brighten up my face. I always inevitably get powder in my eye, somehow. Yeah, that definitely looks a little more <laughs> cohesive. Maybe I thought I was tan and I just like really wasn't. <laughs> Blush. Mm, don't drop, don't drop. 
Okay. <laughs> I'm using the Neutrogena Cheeky Wink Shade First Crush. Love this blush. Thank you, Caitlin. And honestly, I have not been using highlight, especially like since we've been stuck at home. Like I just haven't been using it because honestly, I'm not, if I'm going to like an event or like it's a, you know, specific thing that I need to put makeup on for, I'll obviously like highlight it up and go off. But for days that I'm just like at home where I'm not doing much, I don't really like to wear a highlight because I feel like it just makes my face look more oily because my skin is oily and I don't like that look. So we're not gonna be doing that today. Okay, now I go in with my MAC Studio Fix Powder and I take my little kabuki twisty brush and we're gonna powder up the entire face. This has become my favorite step in my makeup routine because I feel like it literally just like seals the face makeup, you know? I don't know if you could tell the difference from before and after it's on, but like, I don't know, I just feel like it sets everything. Okay, moving on. Setting spray. Okay, now I'm gonna do my brows off camera because they take me five years and be right back. And brows are done. Okay, so next, once my eyebrows are done, I'm gonna just prime my eyelids. I'm not gonna do anything too crazy with eyeshadow, but just like a little something, you know, just to kind of make me feel like I really have my life together. <laughs> We're gonna put on the primer and then I switch back and forth between these two palettes. One of them is called Going Coconuts. The other one is just a Stila palette. If I'm wearing like colors or I have like pink on or something like that I'll normally use this palette and I'll use that pink shade right in the middle but because I'm not and I'm wearing all black today I'm gonna use this one and I typically like to go for a more gold kind of color just because since my eyes are so dark I feel like it kind of helps them pop a little bit more so I'm gonna use this gold shade in the bottom corner which is called essence I'm just gonna take a little bit of that and put it right on my eyelid I love a shimmer shadow. And then I'll just take a fi brush like this, take a dark brown, regardless of which colors on my eyelid, I'll take this dark brown shade and I'll just kind of put a little bit of it in my crease just to make it look like I tried. And we'll try to smoke that out a little bit, bring it into the inner corner. That looks pretty good to me. <laughs> I'll do the same thing on the other side. Okay, and then I will take this little highlighting shade for the brow bone and I'll take just a flat brush like this and I'll kind of just use that to blend out the eyeshadow from my crease and my brow bone and kind of just like clean up the edges. Next eyeliner. I just do a winged, that was really aggressive, like I just do a winged liner, which requires a lot of focus. Not really, I've been doing a winged liner since high school, so I've gotten very, very comfortable with it. Okay, and next is mascara, which if you saw my last vlog, I talked about my favorite, my new favorite mascara combination, which is the Better Than Sex and the L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black Mascara. I put on the Better Than Sex one first, and then I put on the Carbon Black, and I'll show you guys now exactly like how I do that. So I just curled my lashes. I'm gonna apply Better Than Sex mascara first. Okay, so now my Better Than Sex mascara is on and I'm just gonna kinda leave that for now. I'm gonna go to my bottom lash line and I'm gonna take this teeny tiny little angled brush and I'm gonna line up my bottom lash line with the same dark brown that we used in our crease. And I'm just gonna line it real quick, like right underneath my waterline. I really like to do this just because I feel like it helps like tie everything in. Now I'm gonna take a white waterline eyeliner. This one is the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide on Eye Pencil in the shade Y-E-Y-O. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that because I mess it up every time. I'm going to put this in my waterline. I feel like that does a lot. I feel like it really just helps like brighten up the eyes. <laughs> and now I'm going to take the Telescopic Carbon Black Mascara and I'm gonna put it on my top lashes and then my bottom lashes. And at this point, the top lashes are like pretty dry, which helps the L'Oreal Mascara go on a little bit better to enhance the lashes versus clumping it up so much. And we're gonna do one final spray. And to finish it off, I just put on my Laneige Lip Balm. And we're good to go. And that is my everyday makeup routine. Yay! Okay, now this time to check turnip prices on Animal Crossing because I checked them this morning and they were like 58 and I bought them for 104. So that doesn't work for me. Maybe they're different and a little higher now. What? That is such a ripoff. No, that's so annoying. I bought them at 104. This guy's cool, we like him. He sells nice bags. Hi, kicks. <laughs> what do we have? Ooh, those socks look so cute. And the cloth. 
These socks are cute. Ooh. Oh, we might be buying some stuff real quick. Hey friends, I just finished my little 45 minute dose of Animal Crossing and I'm very hungry now. So I'm gonna go downstairs and I'm gonna figure out something I have for lunch. I'm probably gonna do like some type of salad or other. So I'm gonna do that, make my coffee and get on with my day. Also, here's my super fun outfit of the day. My sports bra is Fabletics. My joggers are Fabletics. And then I'm just wearing this Victoria's Secret pink jacket. I switched out of my other one. My other one is from Nike, but it was a little too like heavy and like baggy so i just fixed words sometimes i think faster than my mouth can like speak and it just comes out as gibberish <laughs> i switched into this one because it's a little bit lighter okay let's go get food i need coffee um for today's lunch we have <laughs> bless you a grilled chicken salad with grilled chicken from the air fryer uh romaine lettuce cucumber tomato carrots a little bit of corn dairy-free cheese and olive oil on top oh and cashews <laughs> hi yay go it is <laughs> try go it is yeah. Let's try it for the vlog. Oh my god, that chicken is awesome. Okay, I'm gonna eat now. Okay. Alrighty, friends, we ate our lunch. We got our coffee. I had a different capsule today. I had the caramel cookie one. It's not bad. I definitely can't. It's not one that I want to have like every single day, but it's nice to just like switch it up to have one of them. And it's good. It just tastes, it tastes almost exactly like the Starbucks caramel macchiato. And I don't mind it. Like I actually like it, but it's very like buttery and creamy tasting. And that's not something that I would want to have every day, but it's a nice change for today. It's 3.24 PM. I've got a little bit of plant planning out to do for my virtual privates and stuff so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then around 5 30 is probably my first one so I don't know how much I'm gonna vlog of that just because like those are pri private lessons so I don't know that I'm gonna vlog it or anything but if I do then maybe you'll see some behind the scenes and if not then I guess I'll do after them or something <laughs> Okay friends, so I just finished doing my lesson plans for my flexibility Zooms. I have it all planned out. I have the layout of everything done and I just went ahead and made my Zoom meetings and scheduled them. And now I have about an hour until I have to start. So I'm gonna try to get some inspo for my graduation cap and figure out what I wanna do with that because honestly, I have no idea what I wanna put on it. And I obviously wanna make it like super cute and fun and just like go all out with it. So I'm gonna try to find something to do. Okay, hi. Just now, 19 p.m. I got some boom chicka pop to snack on which hi I have never had boom chicka pop until like a couple days ago. It is my new favorite snack in the world It's so good Oh my god, I think I figured out what I want to do with my grad cap I kind of like know the quote that I want to put on it Which is super cute and then I kind of have an idea of how I want to like decorate it and stuff I just don't know how I want to do that yet I don't know if I want to like take a piece of like cardstock and just like paint and draw on it Or if I want to see if I could probably use the Cricut machine to do something because I feel like with that I could maybe take a paper or something and I can put like stickers or like the cute designs or whatever So just to make it like a little bit easier and prettier and yeah, just gonna hang on I'm glad I got that figured out until my first private starts. Alrighty friends. It is now 7 16 p.m. I just finished my stretching privates and they went absolutely amazing Honestly, it's kind of hard now with everything being virtual and stuff I wasn't sure how it was gonna work, but it went really well I'm actually like super grateful that I've like found a good rhythm and routine going so that the privates can work out virtually Anyway, that was amazing. So now I'm just gonna clean up. I have like all of my stuff just like laid out here I'm gonna clean up and then probably get a snack or something or maybe eat dinner or look into doing that And yeah, what is up? Friends, it is now 10 11 p.m. Honestly, I don't even remember what I last vlogged I think it was like right before I was gonna be starting my privates which went great Then I just honestly hung out. I had a zoom call with Issa, Caitlin, and Christy, which was super super fun and exciting And I ate dinner and that was pretty much it. I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here Thank you guys so 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 much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed it And I will see you super soon in my next one